of the day. So I'm getting a little bit of a later start today than I wanted, but I'm still hitting the gym. I'm gonna be here for half the time that I wanted to. So there's nobody in here. I'll just shut it off if, if somebody comes. It is, oh, like no time to work out. One of my earbuds fell off of my headphones. I only have music in one ear now, but that's okay. Just in case you're wondering, it is possible to get back to working out after a serious joint disease. A few weeks ago, I started working out. I was on a treadmill. I wish the treadmills are in front of me empty. I was in there for six minutes and I wanted to puke. And I just went on an elliptical for 25. Feeling pretty good. No puking. Three, two, one. Almost forgot this. It was my earbud that fell off. Okay, so what has happened? today so far is so I went through my whole morning routine like normal went to the gym for a short amount of time then we had a, a meeting with a missionary downtown and she is a missionary that we support on the front I'm gonna show her picture right now I'm not going to show her face though because I didn't get her permission and I don't want to endanger her in any way but she is a wonderful lady and we love her and we pray for her and ask you please to pray for her too. She's doing very important things and there is fruit. Jesus told the disciples to pray for workers because the harvest is great but the laborers are few. So please pray for our friend at the Atto. That's what they call it in Ukrainian the war zone. So here's what I'm doing now. I'm getting ready for a call. I'm not going to show you his like face and like contact information, stuff like that, because, you know, no permission or whatever. But uh, this is what I, I've been doing for the past like several weeks, calling people and asking if they would like to be on our partner team to uh, pray with us, to support us in what we're doing and to invest in this film that we're making over the summer. This is how we make that call. I've got my computer in front of me, right here, and I've got my everything notebook. You can see I've got my highlighters because my to-do list in the back here, I highlight different tasks with different category colors so I know uh, which things I'm working on at what time. This is church. This is uh, a worship conference that we're working on right now. It's like current project. So we're working on a worship conference. This is home and this is film. So, and then obviously a pen to take notes. So I get my notebook, I get my computer, I pray real quick and there's like two minutes to the call. So I've got to pray real quick. And uh, then I make sure I get my notes in order and I make the call and we talk and we pray together and I, offer to get on the team and they say yes or no and we go from there it's very open god please bless this call and help uh, me to be a, a blessing to this person um and then also god uh, we just trust you for your provision and your direction and your vision in jesus name amen here we go type in the person's name hey bro I am ready when you are. I'm always nervous when this kind of thing starts, but that is okay. Okay, he's not answering. Gonna hit the video call button just for the heck of it, see if he's on here. Should 
should make this into a, like a song or something. I guess that's how the song ends. So, um, my friend, uh, he did not answer the phone, but that's okay. Um, I do have another couple of appointments today, so maybe we can talk with those people and I can show you how those go. Uh, Katya's not feeling well, so I'm gonna walk the dog because I'm working at home today and that helps her out a little bit. And then I'm going to... Okay, so there's this awesome church that supports us, and one of the things that they do that a lot of other churches don't do is they ask us for a yearly report. And so I actually started, because of this church, I started putting together yearly reports um, just for everybody. And uh, this year they gave us specific questions to answer and stuff like that. So um, I am going to be working on that. Then I've got two more phone calls. And then we have home fellowship. And then I've got another phone call after home fellowship. So that's what today looks like. <laughs> Oh, okay, it's been a long day. Outside it is nighttime. I'm gonna make my last phone call of the day. Hey there, this is David over in Ukraine. While I was in America last, I set up this service called Google Voice. Once you have it, you have your own local American phone number and can call any American number for free. Yep. You know, like, that's, that's very important. So, I mean, we're not called to lie, are we? <laughs> Even just to be, to look humble and to be humble and spiritual. In a couple weeks, should I contact you and, and, or a week or two to, to follow up or? Mm-hmm. Okay. Good deal. Yeah, thank you. Lord, I thank you for for his family and uh, also his extended family there and pray that you bless them all, Lord. Help him to have your vision, your direction for the church, for the business, etc. Strengthen his hands and help him to know he's doing a good work, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks a lot for your time. <laughs> yeah, you too. Thank you. God bless. Bye-bye. And that's how we do that. <laughs>